Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. First, I'd just like to say Merry Christmas to all of you that celebrate. And if you don't celebrate, then happy holidays. I hope that you're all doing wonderfully well. Um, today, I thought that I'd share with you guys what I got for Christmas, what I got for Christmas. Because today is Christmas and I thought that I'd share with you guys all the goodies that I have gotten or I've treated myself to. So yeah, if you'd like to see what I got for Christmas, just keep watching. Okay, so the first thing that I want to show you guys is actually a treat to myself. This is the most expensive bag that I've ever bought in my whole life. Um, this is actually a Calvin Klein bag. I fell in love with it. I saw it at Maya and I was like, yep, you are coming home with me. Like, oh my dear goodness, I love this bag so much. Um, yeah, I'm not going to go into too much detail just because I will eventually film a what's in my bag video. So I'll go into more depth about this bag in a future video. <laughs> Okay, so I did get a pair of Tigers. I'm not the biggest sneaker person. Um, however, I have been wanting to get into it a little bit more and I have been ha I have had my eye on these for a while now. I like these because they don't have the suede on them. They are all just leather and I love that because they're just easy to clean and just everything about that is just really good. I believe this is called the dark gray and off white tone and I love these. They would pretty much go with anything in my wardrobe that I would style with sneakers. Are these even sneakers? I've got no idea. Okay, so the first thing that I want to show you guys is the MAC Pro Longwear SPF 20 Compact Foundation in the shade NC30. Um, I will definitely get around to filming first impressions at some stage for you guys, but if you guys saw how many things that I have to first impression, you'd just be like, girl. I did treat myself to two Jeffree Star liquid lipsticks. Um, I got the shade Anna Nicole, which is like an orange red, and then I also got Prom Night. I cannot wait to use these. I haven't used these yet, but I love the Jeffree Star liquid lipsticks. They are bomb. So I also have a few things from Clarins to show you guys. So the first thing that I got was the Everlasting Foundation Plus. Um, I love the traditional Everlasting Foundation, so I was happy to get this one. So this one is in the shade... 110.5 almond and then I'll show you what it looks like in the bottle that's what it looks like there I think that that will be a really really nice foundation to use when I'm a bit more tanned the packaging is a bit more sleek than the traditional one um, purely for the fact that it is all frosted which I think is so luxurious I cannot wait to get my little paws into that one then I also got another um, instant light radiance boosting base um, this one is actually in the shade Champagne. I do love Rose, so I was happy to get Champagne. Um, I've already used this once, and so far I am loving it. It's really, really beautiful, but I still think I like Rose that touch more. So I also got the Clarins Instant Light Lip Perfector. Um, this is in the shade Rosewood Shimmer, and I cannot wait to use it. I haven't used it yet, but I'm very excited to. I did get two perfumes. This one I have wanted for a very long time, so I decided to treat myself. This is the Chanel Chance, just the green one. Oh my goodness. I love this so much. Like, I don't even know why I love it so much. It just smells amazing. And then I also got Victor and Rolf Flower Bomb. Oh my dear goodness. This scent gives me life. Seriously, I love this so much. Also from Chanel, I got the LeBlanc de Chanel Base Lumiere Multi-Use Illuminating Base. It looks like this. This is what the box looks like. It's just very standard Chanel packaging, and it does have a pump as well. I believe the old packaging didn't have a pump, so that's what made me so hesitant to get it all these years. Um, but yeah, I'm super, super excited to give this one a try because I love my illuminating bases. From Illamasqua, I got this highlighter in the shade Rush. So I haven't used this before, but it looked gorgeous. So I was like, yup, I need to get it. This is what it looks like in the pan. And I cannot wait to test this one out. It looks gorgeous. And I feel like I'm going to fall in love very hard, very fast over this one. Also from Illamasqua, I got the lipstick in the shade Starkus. Sorry, my camera cut out and I'm not too sure where. But anyway, this is the lipstick here. I've never tried an Illamasqua lipstick before, but I'm super excited too. This color looks gorgeous. 
So I also got gifted an Illamasqua palette. Um, this one is called the Sculpting Palette. And it's basically just got six shades and I'm in love with this palette. I was actually going to buy it, but I didn't want to fork out the cash for it. So I'm so glad that I got it for Christmas. This palette seriously gives me life. I could probably use it on my eyes as well as on my cheeks. So I am so ridiculously excited. So I also got two palettes from Zoeva. I got the Naturally Yours palette, which is this one right here. And I'll show you guys what it looks like inside. This is what it looks like inside. Seriously, how gorgeous is this palette? Like, can we just take a minute? Like seriously, it is gorgeous. This is right up my alley and I can see myself using this every single day. No joke. And then I also got the Rose Golden palette. This is this one here. I do feel like this one, the packaging is just a little bit more luxurious just because of how each pan is surrounded by this rose gold like pattern. I don't know, but I just think this is gorgeous as well. Super happy to add this to my collection. And then also from Zoeva, I got a lipstick. This one's the shade Cooling Passion. I've been wanting to try Zoeva makeup for a while, so I'm very glad that I got these. Um, their packaging, can I just say, it's super luxurious. Like it's a magnetized packaging. So yeah, super gorgeous. And then seriously, if this is not a Laura color, then I don't know what is. This color looks gorgeous and right up my alley. I'm not wearing it today, but I'll definitely wear it sometime soon. Okay guys, so the last two things that I have to show you are actually a gift to myself. I bought both of the sets of the Chi Chi Viva La Diva lipsticks. These things are great value for money. Each one of these full price is $38, which I think is amazing considering you're getting four full size lipsticks. So I guess I'll just show you guys what lipsticks come in each set. So I'm going to go through the bright set first. Okay, so the first lipstick is this hot pink one. It's called Glamazon. This looks gorgeous and I cannot wait to get so much more use out of this one. The next shade is actually what is on my lips at the moment and it's called Countess. I love this shade. This is probably my new favorite red. I'm not even kidding you. Like seriously, can we just take a minute to appreciate? I actually wore this to my work Christmas party and it lasted so well through all the eating and all the drinking and all the talking. It lasted so well. And I've been doing this so much recently. <laughs> and then we also have Hot Mama, which is more of an orange toned red. And then we have Lady Bum. This is a gorgeous, like, purpley tone. I cannot wait to use this in the winter time. Seriously, yes. Now I'll show you guys the nudes palette or the nude set, I should say. So the first one is Check In. This is the lightest nude in the palette. Why do I keep saying palette? I don't know. You can tell that I've already used this one and I like layering this one in the center of the lips just to make the lips look a bit more like voluptuous. And then there's also Drop Dead Gorgeous, which is an amazing like Kylie Jenner, mauve pinky color, which is so pretty. And then we also have Sex Bomb. I love this shade. This shade is like the perfect like nude color, at least for me. I love this shade so much. And then also Game On. This is like the perfect pink. I've used this so much already, you can tell. I love this so much. Okay guys, so that is all that I got for Christmas this year. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please don't forget to like and subscribe and even comment down below what you got for Christmas this year as well because I would love to know. So yeah, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day and I will see you next time. Bye.